Hello my beautiful little honeys. I hope you're all doing really well. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be an Aldi haul. You guys seem to love them. I don't know why. Don't know what it is but every Aldi and Tesco haul that I put up seems to be like the most viewed video. So I feel like you guys just seem to really like them. So today I thought I would film another one. Let's just go. Let's crack on. No point beating around the bush. Hello! Okay, I'm back from shopping now. You guys know that we just get this stuff every week. So filtered milk, three of those this week. I have started making little healthy smoothies. So we need an extra milk this week. So we've got three of the filtered whole 3.7% fat and two of the big milk. I talk about this all the time, you guys know. The wee one just seems to love it. Then, don't get me started on these little badgers. £3.30! They cost, I think they were about £2 because there's only four. But what has happened to the world? £3 bloody 30 Inflation! A wee tin of Heinz beans. A wee cucumber. Um, I don't know. They just seem to be better than Aldi cucumbers. I know that's probably a little bit controversial. But there you go. Then I picked up some of the Lint Caramel Sea Salt Dark Chocolate. I think this was only £1.60, which is quite reasonable, really, isn't it? And then, heavy duty stuff this week. My drains are blocked. <laughs> Don't think you guys had to know that, but there you go. Clears total blockages guaranteed or your money back. Why do I feel like that doesn't actually make any sense? Have you ever seen anything more adult in your whole life? Buying drain cleaner for your flipping blocked drains. Uh yeah. Oh, apparently five minute action. I'm very excited to give this a wee bash and see if it actually clears the drains because my kitchen sink is just not running efficiently because the drains are fucked, basically. So hopefully Mr. Muscle sorts it right out. And then I picked up a little Dettol antibacterial all-in-one disinfectant spray. I've never tried the summer fruit one before, so today I am. And apparently it kills COVID-19 virus. So we're going to be spraying it over everything and over everyone. <laughs> Kidding. So it's the summer fruit one. It's got a cheeky wee apple, cheeky wee watermelon. Is that a peach? A peach? And then lastly, we got this. I'm not going to say it out loud because I've got a small child behind me who will definitely want this and he's just had a snack. So there you go. Some of that. Very, very nice. Again, I think this is like £2.50 for four. I don't know what it is about healthier food. I just feel like it's always more expensive. But for now, that's my little Tesco haul. I know, it's very exciting. Moving on to Aldi, we got these. They creep me out. I don't know what it is, but they creep me out. Kurt the Croc toothbrush. Does anyone else that is a parent out there feel like they buy a toothbrush every couple of weeks? I don't know what my child does with them. I think he actually chews the toothbrush. Scotch pies, absolute staple. Eggs, tortilla wraps, lasagna sheets. Pancakes. I don't know what is wrong with me at the moment. I am obsessed with pancakes. I'm obsessed with making them. It's all I think about. And I cannot wait till I finish this video and I rip open these pancakes and just probably inhale about two of them because that's what I do. Ham. Dark chocolate digestives. In my opinion, might be controversial. I prefer these over the milk chocolate. They're banging. I got some of the lemon and strawberry compote whipped yogurts. They're actually really nice. I like them. And then we get these every week at the moment. They're just really, really nice. They are the Waves Multigrain Sour Cream and Black Pepper and the Sweet Chili. Not tried these ones yet, but they are. Like, these ones are really nice. Black Currant Jam. Passata. We got a big pizza at the back, the big cheese one. I didn't realise I've actually picked up the sharing one, you know, like the one you tear apart rather than the actual pizza. Doesn't matter. I'm sure it'll still be nice. I really like the big cheese, actually. Would you believe? Extremely cheesy. It's very, very nice. Sweet corn, fish fingers, two cheese, chicken goujons, some garlic bread. It's just an absolute staple. Then we've got some of the ultra dry Mamiya 
air system nappies. And then these are like the little night pant ones. Two baby wipes. Three whole packets of apples. I'm on an apple thing at the moment. I've started making this little smoothie where it's like milk, apple, avocado, like this green powder. It sounds disgusting. It's absolutely delightful. So loving the apples at the moment. Strawberries, two of the easy peel, uh, what are these? Easy peel orange things. Three bananas. Sometimes I put banana in that smoothie too. There's only two here. I've put one away already, but we've got three bananas, grapes, two packets of avocados, mushrooms, cucumber. I've already showed you that. A packet of the sweet mini peppers. They're really, really nice. Got the Albert Bartlett potatoes, spinach at the back, sweet potato, tomatoes. These actually look very, very fancy. They're the piccolo tomatoes. Um, you probably get like three of them for like £10, but they just look really nice. So I'm excited to try them. They're the only ones they had, which is why I probably spent about £10 on them. <laughs> I wouldn't usually do such things. Can't remember if I've showed you the carrot and the spinach. Two broccoli, sugar snap peas, two of these soft baked filled chocolate hazelnut things. Cashew, Cajun, garlic and herbs breadcrumbs and then we have got creme fraiche which is for my vegeta pasta that I make, single cream and two Greek yogurt. Moving on to meal stuff we've got haddock goujons for the little one, two of the melt in the middle salmon fish cakes. These actually sound quite nice. So they come with like a buttery hollandaise sauce in the middle with a golden crumb and they just sound absolutely delightful. A wee pack of meatballs. I got a little packet of chicken breast mini fillets. They're for making like goujons and stuff. And then we've got some mince at the back for a wee lasagna. Although I'm thinking that's definitely not a min a big enough mince for a lasagna. Oh dear. And then a pack of pork sausages. And then last but not least, loaf of bread. And that's it. Another little Aldi haul. There you go, thanks for coming. Finished. I hope you guys, look, guys. <laughs> I hope you guys really enjoyed watching that little food shop haul. I don't know what it is about them. I quite like watching them too and I think I'm just really nosy when it comes to this kind of thing. I just love seeing what people are having for their dinner. What you guys will probably notice when you watch a few of these videos is that I tend to get a lot of the same stuff every week and that's because we're just total creatures of habit in this house we kind of buy the same things like week in week out obviously with a few exceptions but yeah i hope you guys really enjoyed watching it and i'll see you soon